Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will soon welcome their first child into the world. While the royal baby will be brought up surrounded by the British monarchy, it may never meet its maternal grandfather, a new documentary has claimed. Will Thomas Markle ever meet his grandchild? Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will soon welcome their first child into the world. While the royal baby will be brought up surrounded by the British monarchy, it may never meet its maternal grandfather, a new documentary has claimed. Will Thomas Markle ever meet his grandchild? The former lighting director didn't attend the royal event after he was exposed for selling staged paparazzi pictures. Now a shocking preview for a TLC documentary, Meghan and Harry, a royal baby story, has suggested that Thomas may never meet his grandchild. Thomas has been vocal about how much he hopes to meet his grandchild and has publicly spoken about how his desire to be a part of his daughter's life. But royal biographer and expert Duncan Larkham, who was interviewed in the TLC documentary, claims the chances of Meghan and her father being reunited are slim. Mr. Larkham said, I can't think for a minute that Thomas Markle will ever be able to meet his grandson or granddaughter. Meghan's father recently appeared on Good Morning Britain to speak with Piers Morgan and admitted to being hopeful that the birth of his daughter's child would help bring the pair together. Thomas Markle told a friend he will follow the happy event on Mexican TV because he isn't expecting a call from Meghan, Prince Harry or even one of their aides. He was not even aware the couple have set up an Instagram account where they will post photos of their newly born infant, but insists he will become an avid follower like everyone else. Mr. Markle's friend said on Saturday, he is genuinely thrilled that his daughter is expecting her first child later this month. He's been looking around baby stores for an appropriate gift to send. He even jokes the new arrival was likely to be showered with expensive baby items from Tiffany with a little welcome to Tijuana t-shirt from him in the middle. Joking aside though, the distance in miles and emotions between him and Meghan hasn't stopped him feeling proud for her and his new grandchild. He aims to sink a couple of bears in his local bar when he or she is born but he'd give anything to meet the new arrival in person and hopes he can prove to his daughter that their relationship is worth a second chance and he should have a place in their lives. He is still clinging to the hope his daughter will call him at some stage to share her happiness. Meghan's half-sister Samantha Markle, 54, also appears in the documentary clip and claims Meghan has hurt the family. Meghan has stayed silent amid an array of public outbursts by both Samantha and her father. She and Harry are busy preparing to welcome their baby. They have reportedly splashed £33,000 on a Hampshire Babylon to enjoy some time away together before the birth. The parents-to-be have moved into their new Windsor home, Frogmore Cottage, where they spent thousands on a new nursery. The bookies have backed April 21st, which is Easter Sunday and Queen Elizabeth II's birthday as the royal baby's most likely due date Meghan had stayed silent amid an array of public outbursts by both Samantha and her father. She and Harry are busy preparing to welcome their baby. They have reportedly splashed £33,000 on a Hampshire Babylon to enjoy some time away together before the birth. The parents-to-be have moved into their new Windsor home, Frogmore Cottage, where they spent thousands on a new nursery. The bookies have backed April 21st, which is Easter Sunday and Queen Elizabeth II's birthday as the royal baby's most likely due date. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to get instant news update.